photo of me and my grandmother, Benita Montoya. This is my two best friends and I at the Christmas tree lighting. This is my family, and this is one of the last times that we were together this past year. The picture I chose to represent my journey at St. Mary's was this one of my family and I, and it's a constant reminder of the sacrifices and the resilience that my family has always shown me. And this photo really means a lot to me because she won't be able to attend my law school graduation in person, but she's been a big influence throughout my life. She's just represented such a strong person who's gotten through a lot of tough times in her life. This is a photo of my mother and I. She's been wrongfully convicted and incarcerated for the past eight years, which is what drove me to come to St. Mary's Law. I have a huge passion for social justice and criminal justice reform and prison reform. These are the three most important people in my life. Um, they're the ones that inspire me to do better and they push me and they also support me through everything that I do including changing my major like two times here at St. Mary's. Um, the night before I moved into my dorm my freshman year, I was very scared and nervous to start college. So my mom gave me this picture and framed it for me so that I could have it with me. My family has been my biggest inspiration and my biggest support system throughout my entire journey here at St. Mary's University. And what's really funny about this picture is it was taken at St. Mary's High School in St. Louis, Missouri, my alma mater, and here my brother's alma mater. Ever since I can remember, we would, me and my entire family, we would walk over to St. Mary's University and we would sit by the softball stadium, we would walk around the track together, just to get outside. Um, and that's where this picture is. All my siblings together, those days are the reason I decided to come here to St. Mary's. For me, this photo represents the community and family spirit that exists around this campus. I'm so thankful for the community that I've been able to find, for the home away from home that I was able to find. I'm so thankful for all the friends, the peers, the mentors, my bosses, who've all helped influence me and shape me into the person that I am today. It's such a personal experience here. Um, I feel like I got to know everybody by their name and need and even just communicating to everybody. It feels like a family here. I chose this picture because it really means to me a lot given that we took this picture on the New Year's Eve before I came back to St. Mary's after COVID. I'm a very family oriented person and St. Mary's has become my second home and my second family here through the friendships that I've made and the professors that have pushed me and challenged me to be a better student and a better person. Here is where my marriage tradition started and through St. Mary's University my marriage traditions grew and I will continue to do them throughout my career. St. Mary's is a really special place and I know that because I can feel that I'm in a family here, just like back home, because I found a home away from home here. Wherever I go, whoever I meet, whatever life brings to me, all I know is that I'll always be a Rattler.